because the idea of war comes also only from the men to begin with. <coughs> I must admit, it is not difficult to collect money for poor women in the developing countries and help them to get out of their poverty. But unfortunately my knowledge is that the money we are collecting may not reach the poor women, but may end up into the pockets of the corrupt ministers, bureaucrats and other people in charge and ultimately it will end up in the Swiss bank. I do not want to criticize any UN organization because I know they are very honest in their purpose. But they must be made aware of what is happening under the table. We in India have two very big states called as I have Uttar Pradesh and Bihar, which are very much helped by UNICEF as well as the World Health Organization. UNICEF started a project called Angan, meaning Gotar, where the children were to be educated and brought up in a proper shape. This project is not working at all for the children, but all the money goes into the pockets of all the corrupt people who are in charge of that project and the children do not even get 2% of what is being sent for them. Same with the World Health Organization, which is sending medicines and equipment to India. These medicines are sold in the market and are completely used by the recipients for their own gain. The same happens to WHO equipment, so the poor people never get any benefit and they remain all the time helpless. All this money is called dirty money but goes to the clean Swiss bank. A large part of the loans a large part of the loans which, we, which, which the World Bank gives to the developing countries is also siphoned back to the personal accounts of the corrupt officials maintained in Swiss banks. Thus all these developing countries are indebted to the World Bank but have no money. The money is in the Swiss bank. So I would request the UN to take this up with the Swiss bank and request them to return all such money which has been siphoned to them. <laughs> by very corrupt people and give this money to the UN so that the UN can utilize it for the education of women and other purposes as well as for distributing to people under very effective vigilance. One has to have a very good network of people, especially women, who are involved and who are honest, compassionate and who would like to make the best out of this money helping the women who have to achieve social equality. The main work of womanhood is to create a good society that would enjoy peace better.